So, hi, Oldfingham. How are you doing? Uh, I'm prepared tonight. I've got myself me, my coffee, and both. And as you can see, I've got a table to put it on. A nice brand new black table, but a super sexy black table. Uh, it's actually a TV table, TV stand, but it does the job. It'd probably do even better once we get the legs back to this sofa, which will lift us up a little bit, but there you go. So I've even got somewhere to stash all this stuff here tonight. So, up you, hi, how are you doing? Uh, before we start here tonight, um, la, 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 la. as I normally say, this may be long, it may be short, uh, and this isn't going to be a competition this week to see how many times I can say, said the vicar to the tar, how many times I can tap that onto the end of what I say. So, I'll try and give that up a little bit tonight, but if one or two do slip in there, then please let me know about it, and I apologise for that, said the vicar to the tar, but hey, there we go. So, that's my little ramble over. Uh, how are you, old finger? How are you doing? What have you been up to? Uh, I have a few notes for me tonight. I well, uh, don't often write any stuff down before the start. I like to take these Wednesdays just as they come. If you'd like to take part, incidentally, you can do. Comment for me down there on comments, funnily enough. Or you can also give us a call here in the studio. I'm proper set up this time. A speaker, so you can hear what's going on if somebody calls. So, why don't you give it a try? 07 And we're lining you guys to take part in these Wednesdays, and we'll make them whatever we want them to be. Fair enough? Okay. Uh, I have got that little music in the background again. That this place freaks me out a bit where we are here in A4 Studios and just before I was about to go live here I heard a hell of a banging outside and voices and I thought, oh my god, here we go again. So I had a little peep out there and it was just some young nutters who were passing by and uh, thought it gave me a bit of a fright based on what's been going on here the last couple of weeks. You may have seen I did a little bit of a ghost hunt. Uh, there's an official ghost hunt coming up here at A4. I'm going to let you know about that. But as far as I'm aware, it's a closed event. So, we'll see. Now, that remains to be seen anyway. So, there's just a few things that I want to say about Old Fringham tonight. Um, first of all, quite importantly, there was an attack on uh, Pickering Lodge Park a little while back. Um, on the page there today, you'll see there's been a, an image released of some idiot that uh, GMP are looking for. Down there, give it a share. Uh, that, would, that would be good. Uh, okay, so guys, uh, something else on our page which is a bit of an interest to me, particularly given the ghosty stuff lately, is the film called Once Bitten. It's a vampire film. There's a little bit of that down there on our page, uh, provided by Anna over at Sir Holtringham. Uh, it, it, it's a vampire film, and it was shot here, well some of it, in Holtringham. Uh, our canteen, it was the hotel room down here at A4 where they shot it, and everything looks exactly the same as it was when they did the film. Um, being on your own in this building at night, it is a little bit freaky sometimes, but uh, anyway, there you have it. So other than that, old finger, like I say, I'm, I'm relying on you on these Wednesdays to get involved. Tell me what you want to do with them, where we're going to go with it, what you want to talk about. Give me a call, talk about old finger. You can do that on 07874 055611 if you so wish. Or the comments down here on the screen which I see there are no comments so far, that's fine. Uh, you've missed a little bit off the start there, but hey, okay. Uh, so, yeah, guys, get involved. 07 Let's make these Wednesdays whatever we want them to be. I've had my little waffle from my notes here, so let's just see how long we can stretch this out for, hey? 
What well, something else that I will mention that you saw on the page a little while back there. Um, we'll jump straight in, tell it how it is. All through the news, we uh, we're all struggling to catch up with ourselves because all through the news gets bigger uh, than we anticipated. Uh, not that we're complaining, we're doing that for your support. But it, it's getting bigger, people are taking us more seriously. We sometimes scramble to catch up because it was all started just a little bit of fun. Um, well, this is where we are now. And we are looking for one, maybe one or two donations, uh, if you'd like us to advertise your commercial business here on AM. Uh, we can provide you with some view stats if you want. If uh, you want to check them out, then let us know. But uh, that's the way it is. There's a note down there on the page about that as well. So, okay, so. 07-874-055611 if you'd like to say hi. I'd uh, be, I'd be more than chuffed to take a call from you. Tell me what's been going on in your altering room life. Um, this Wednesday has tended to be about 15 minutes long over the last few weeks. I'm trying to get into the stride a bit, trying to find where I want to go with it, see what you guys want. I I do want more involvement from you chaps. You can do that on the phone. It is 07 or down here in the comments. Hi Rach, thanks for joining. Uh, something else that's going on tomorrow, right here on all City News, this very sofa, in fact, so we'll have to move our washing table out a little bit. Uh, Mike Williams from Radio Wishing Well will be here with us tomorrow. If you want to know a little bit more about Radio Wishing Well, then Mike's coming out to join us to tell us all about that and how you can help out. Because once a month we go up to Trafford General Hospital, Chris and myself and Joe sometimes, and we do a little hour or so show up there on Radio Wishing Well. Great fun. Um, Mike's making a return visit down here to our studio tomorrow evening. I understand around about 8 o'clock. If you'd like to try and catch that, then we'll put a note on the page about that when it's confirmed. Oh! Something else that hasn't been confirmed to my knowledge is we mentioned Old Fringham in Bloom's Skipton Mill Society Gorgeous Gardens competition on the page. Uh, we were expecting a winner. Uh, we do know that the winner was selected on Saturday. Um, I suppose I should be better prepared, shouldn't I, with uh, actually being on the old, uh, old Shingle Bloom Committee and I don't have this information. Hi Chris, thanks for being there buddy, again. So that weird, why do you keep watching this trouble? Anyway, so Old Shingle Bloom, uh, Gorgeous Gardens. It was drawn on Saturday. Um, I suspect then that Sarah Wormsley from Ultra Gimme Bloom is actually holding it back and is going to do some sort of official press release about that with the winner's details. Maybe the winner's not even been notified yet, maybe that's what it is. So, as we find out, we'll let you know about that if you answer. Uh, and there's also some more results of competition as such on our page this week. Also down there, you'll see a couple of the winners here at A4. You might have caught our live stream um, a few days back, last week, whenever. Oh, I'm still busy, you know! Um, the winners of the exhibition, the Air Open exhibition that took place here a few days ago. Uh, there will be another one coming up here at uh, A4 Studios. Uh, I've been told what it's about, but I'm going to hold off with giving you an idea, just in case I'm not supposed to. Uh, I wouldn't want to upset you guys here at A4, because it's quite nice being here at home. So, okay guys, so I've pretty much given you what I normally do on a Wednesday. You tell me what you'd like me to do with these. So brought you a little bit of old Hingham stuff with me, not much granted, because these Wednesdays are designed to get you guys involved and your opinion. So before I go, I'll give it another try, 
please join me in the comments or right there on that speaker so everybody can hear you because I'm organised. You can give us a call 07 874 uh, 055 Another thing I will say. Altringham, if you spotted my personal Twitter at all, a uh, few weeks back now I did a few of these on the, the subjects of noisy travels. Uh, no, the, the subjects of mental health. <coughs> Excuse me, health. <coughs> <coughs> I've had a bad dose of mouth flu and it's dropped onto my chest. I don't like that I'm old. Yes, so. Um, I did a few on the issue of mental health. I was saying on my personal Twitter that I might come back to that. There is a reasoning behind that. I won't go into detail, but uh, I thought it might be useful for me, if not anybody else, to document that in some way. So I think I might make that a little section of these Wednesdays. I'd like to keep going with these Wednesdays. I'd like you guys to get involved. Fair enough. It's a two-way street, hey? Oh seven eight seven four oh double five six double one. I'll bore you for fifteen minutes now. If I had more, I'd bore you for longer. But unfortunately, I haven't, and that's the way it is. Uh, if you want to know who this guy is, uh, to be honest, I don't know. He's been kicking around the studio for quite a while now. And he never really had a name, and he's been a bit neglected, and unlike old Eric, where well, Eric's over there tonight. So I'm trying to think of a name for it. I'm thinking Ernie, Eric and Ernie, paying homage to them, uh, some two of the world's best comedians. I M H O, of course. So, I don't know, what should we call him? One last time then, 07 874 If you'd like to give us a quick call before we go, say hi to Altringham, say hi to me, tell me where to go, it's entirely up to you. I can handle it, nothing worse than the back before. Or down there in the comments on the page, guys. Either way, thanks for popping in and out if you've been here, if you've gone, if you've come back, if you're thinking, what the hell is that? Then I get it. It's okay. It's fine. Oh seven eight seven four. <laughs> I've forgotten the old number. Anyway, guys, it's up there in the description if you'd like to give us a call. Uh, yeah. So thank you for those who already joined. I'll stretch this fifteen minutes. I'm gonna get you a bit of a runny nose. It's actually warm in here tonight. Freezing cold normally. Uh, it's that ghosty thing that comes over you, I suppose, but hey, there we have it. So, chaps, I'm going to leave that there then. I've done 15 minutes, and I'm going to work on these Wednesdays. I nearly brought you something totally different this Wednesday. It looks like a game as such, but I'm not prepared. It's handy, isn't it? It's never prepared. So, maybe next Wednesday, or maybe as a special live on that old trigger. Who knows? Still looking for help over there from you guys. Have a look over, give it a like, see what's going on. Maybe you can help us out, maybe you'd like to get involved. We'd love to see it. So, I think guys, very quiet in the comments. I think maybe I'm done here for another Wednesday. Don't forget, tomorrow night, 8 o'clock, as I understand it, so Chris and myself will be here with Mike Williams from Radio Gushingwell. The return visit to our radio woohoo that we do up at uh, Radio Gushingwell once, uh, once a month. Hi Rob. Am I planning to do another ghost hunt? Uh, I said right at the, the top of this video actually, the there is going to be an official ghost hunt um, on Halloween. Uh, as I understand it at the moment, it's a closed event. But I suppose now I've told to you guys about it, if there's enough interest, uh, maybe we can talk John into making it a public event. In mm, I, I, I don't know though, because there's a lot of building work going on at each end of the building. That could be difficult. But well, I'm certainly up for doing another one, uh, Rob. I'd love it. The last one I did was 
typically over on that soldering gun. Uh, not much happened, there was a little bit, but it was nothing like the one that I recorded after last Wednesday's live. Maybe it's a weekly thing. Uh, it's looking very dark out there, but I've got my ghost hunting torch. So that's cool, no problem. Yeah. So, unless anybody is going to give me uh, a quick call before I leave, the number is 07874 055 Tell me how your day has been, what you're up to, what you think of altering gum, what you think of altering news, anything that takes your fancy, or do so in the comments. I'll stretch this for a couple of minutes. I bet that's gone cold, bear with me. Ugh. Nearly, I can handle Clink, clink. I can handle lukewarm coffee. Not so much uh, tea. Lukewarm tea. Ugh. No. And that first cup of tea in the morning, when you forget to put sugar in, doesn't that ruin your whole day? You have to dump an extra one in to make up for it. Reward yourself for having to go through it. Yeah, been there. So, guys, okay, thank you. I'm done. I'm out of here for another Wednesday. Uh, carry on with the comments on this video if you want. Tell me what you want to see. Please get involved. Uh, I'll be here again next Wednesday. I'll be here with Chris tomorrow with Mark Williams uh, from Radio Wishing Well. We'll also be back boring you to death on Sunday as usual. Uh, so until then, I'm going to be out of here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Me, Mark, Chris. Take care, Alfred.